Yeah, what's up everyone? Welcome to your Texan. Alright, in this video I will be showing you how to fix uh, uh, dead keys like this. Uh, let's check it together. I decided to do a complete video to show everything today. So, if you see what I'm doing here, yeah, let me adjust this so you can see what I'm doing. So, let's check for the keys that are not good. This is good. This is bad. So, let's shade it so we can identify it. This is good. So this is fairly my shit. But, uh, this is bad. This is good. So we have 10 dead keys on it. So let's fix it together. Let's check it. It's just very, very simple. Let me adjust this camera so you see everything. Okay, so you can see everything. So let's go to the back and um, identify those keys that are back. So this is Tashio. CTK 5100 uh, So we don't need to open this entire area uh, There is a plate here um, I have so something like this at the bottom Something like this, so all you need to do is just lose the boot Once you lose that, it will come up For some other keyboard, you have to open the entire area But for this one, it's just here so, so that we can identify this key so this one is bad so we'll press it and check it from the back and mark it so we can easily know it yeah. so it's at this point then these two are bad let's check it from this area these two okay, sorry, let me check it again these two these are the, the area this and this okay let's check for the others then this one too this one is bad too so I can mark it here then we have another one here so the last one is here and check this here too which are the other one yeah this this is the rebooter then we have this back here back this here I'm marking it here too then which are the other one this is the last two this and this So now we know those keys that are 40. You can see the first one is this. I marked this 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Those are the 10. Remember, we count them initially. So this is what we'll do. Uh, we'll deal with it segment by segment. We'll first fix the side. We'll check it. We'll see. Uh, most time it can be due to, to two things. Dirty is the major one most time. Dirty it can be the major cause. Another thing is uh, this part and the rubber there. When the the lead on it 
it's not too strong again it's fading away it, or it will make it to the filling or you'll be having some double knot or if some of this your diet are filling but that is very very rare it is either this or that is so let's continue to see the likely cause of this one so we have to check along the way So that's what's fixed that side. Let's fix the side first. So we have to lose the boat there. Let me see if my camera is too focused. Okay, good. Be able to save the bit now. So let's lose this. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you find it very helpful. This is the truck part. So, if you have a brush, you can just clean it. Just clean the surrounding. This one, that's number two. So you can take your pencil, go to it. This is the number two day. Just rub it at the tip. Let me take it where you can see where. See it? You can see me rubbing the head with my pencil. Because because the contact is filling. to this place the line there just rub it softly not too hard just softly all right that's that for that one then the next one is this which is here so you'll be the same thing very soft Just the line there. Just have been the line that has faded away on it. So, I thought the time I don't want this video to be too long, but this is basically the procedure. I want to get it in here. Okay, so this and this. So, we can apply the lead on it. Too. Second one, we did the same procedure. You can see it's just an HP pencil, you can use any type you have, either to be or anything to still work. Okay, 
So let's try it out now. And ensure this rubber really is set to. And let's clip it back. Let's just tie some one or two. Mind you, if you do not set it properly, uh, if you don't set it properly, you may not have a sign because you know it may not intersect with the uh, with the terminal of those rubbers. So take your time to do that properly. I'm just going to tie three boots so we can use it to just test. So now let's check it out. Remember these are the keys, this, this and this. Let's check. Let's check it now if it will work or not. You can see it. You can see. It. These are the dead keys before. <laughs> you can see those are the three we just fixed now. But I just show you so that you see that the procedure works well. So. This rubber did not really set to it, that's why for this one. So, so we just go there and we'll check. We'll just ensure this one really set to it. Nice wrap on here. So, if we can correct this one, then you just uh, lose the panel, adjust the rubber away. Then, for the others, just repeat the same procedure. Remember when you are applying the pencil. Don't make it too harsh. Don't make it too harsh. Keep it very, very soft, as much as possible, and you are good to go. You will solve all the issue. All right. If you find this video very helpful, do it to like, share, and subscribe. See you in my next video. Cheers.